Tonight, investigators say the suspected gunman in Winthrop was motivated by hate. And that it appears he was acting alone. That suspect opened fire, killing Air Force veteran Ramona Cooper and retired state trooper David Green after crashing a stolen truck in Winthrop on Saturday. Our team coverage of this deadly attack begins with WBZ's Christina Hager. Hate has no home here, says the sign. In a late afternoon news conference, Suffolk District Attorney Rachel Rollins saying the gunman had hate in his heart when he shot and killed retired Massachusetts state trooper and military veteran David Green and Air Force veteran Ramona Cooper. And this person had some very disturbing beliefs, um, white supremacist beliefs regarding uh, the Jewish members of our Jewish population, as well as black uh, individuals. He was such a wonderful person. David Green's brother, Aria Green. When he heard that there was an accident, and he went to investigate, see if he could help, which is something he would, you know, he would readily do. Before taking Green's life, the DA says Nathan Allen slammed a truck he stole into this building, then shot and killed Cooper, an Air Force veteran who spent years after her service working with other veterans, her son, Gary Cooper. I got sick to my stomach when I found out about it was racially motivated. Their family has such a, a wonderful reputation and... Um, it's, 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 it's a sin. It's wrong. Tony Catrone knew Green's family growing up. They were all so nice. And, you know, my town, this is my, my town. It, we should never have to worry about that. The district attorney said she wanted to assure the community the gunman is not connected to any larger group that could pose a threat. She says she feels confident the threat has been neutralized. In Winthrop, Christina Hager, WBC News.